are finally on our way to Sayulita. My name is Jordan, and for the last nine years, I've been living for what many might have looked like a dream. I was a real estate broker in one of the fastest growing cities of America, but for some reason could just never quite find happiness. After being diagnosed with a rare, incurable eye disease that oftentimes leads to blindness, I decided now more than ever is a time for me to follow my true dreams, which is to see the world. So I packed up my bags, packed up my home, and bought a one-way ticket across the world. During my solo travels, I rediscovered a new meaning for life and found that there was hope for me to heal my own body. I am so excited that you're joining me on this journey as I rediscover me and find that this diagnosis was the best thing that ever happened to me. So from what seemed like several hours at the cash exchange place, we are finally on our way to Sayulita. finally. just got to the room here at La Jolla and it is so beautiful like definitely feeling these vibes this is the last weekend with these boobies So we are in Sayulita at La Jolla Retreat Center. Um, we found this retreat center on Instagram. Um, I was looking for different retreat centers in Sayulita and stumbled upon this place. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. There's like lush greenery everywhere. It's right on the water. So like in our rooms, um, you literally hear the ocean crashing all night, which is beautiful. Um, it's like this place is very much set up for people who do yoga. So there's like a little yoga shala outside. The pool is an infinity pool that sits right on the ocean. So it's beautiful. Um, this place is just, it's gorgeous. It is ducked off a little bit away from town. So you do have to take a taxi to get back and forth to like the main plaza area. But this is great if you want to be in Sayulita, but you don't want to be in the town because the town is, you know, bumping and it has a lot of stuff going on. So this is just kind of like a happy medium to be close. So we have been trying to get out of here for about an hour. We're trying to make it to this little <laughs> town area now. <laughs> and I also saw you there, down there, and I thought you were waiting for a cup. No! So we got here. We've never been here before, oh, so we're okay. trying to figure out what to do. So you want to go to town? Ashley, Ashley and I just got into a car with a stranger. Yeah, it, it was, was fun though. He was so nice. He's from Argentina, and I got to practice my Spanish with him. And he's just dropped us off. We didn't have to walk down these crazy steep hills. No, now we're in the town. So Sayulita is everything that I dreamt and more. I'm so happy. So I was so excited to come to Sayulita because it's basically the beach, the jungle, and the mountains all in one location. So we're just getting back to the room after exploring, after exploring and I love Sayulita 
and I want to move here. <laughs> so we're about to head back to the room and just relax for the evening. So I just woke up and we're here at La Jolla Retreat Center in Sayulita in the little jungle. Our room is like right on the water and you just heard like the ocean all night like super loud so it's just been like so beautiful. <sighs> I'm gonna get some work done um, this morning and then yeah I get going for the day. This pool is probably the prettiest pool I've ever seen. I'm kind of just, you know, low-key about it, but it's really, really pretty. Oh, wow. So we are about to go into town, and we just shot some content at the pool because we're super influencers. <laughs> but uh, we've been at La Jolla since yesterday, and we're here for two nights and just kind of exploring Sayulita. And yeah, so we're gonna go into town and then we're going to um, go for a hike through the jungle so we can go watch the sunset. And then we might go watch live music tonight with a girl that I connected with on Instagram. So yeah. So we're spending a couple more days in Sayulita and then we're heading back to Nuevo Huerta for my surgery. Are you having fun, Ashley? Yes. The only thing I don't like is these stupid streets. <laughs> we're waiting on our taxi. We're gonna go get some vegan food. For me at least. <laughs> so something we're realizing is that taxis are really hard to get. So if you come out here to Sayulita, make sure that you're staying in walking distance to the town. Or call a taxi like an hour before you're supposed to go because Apparently taxis are really hard to come by. So we're catching a ride with the masseuses from our resort because we couldn't get a ride. But we're about to go eat. We finally made it. We're about to go find something to eat because we're both hungry. Super hungry. So we just walked up this steep ass hill to try to find fruit and it's not up here. So, we're going back down now. <laughs> Ashley, how do you feel about the fact that you have food? I'm just ready to eat. I know you are, because you're getting real hungry. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> we're, we're about to eat. It's 2.30 and we're finally eating. It took us an hour to get here because of no taxis. And then it took us like 30 minutes to find a location to eat some fruit. So we, this is our second day or third day at La Jolla Retreat Center in Sayulita and this little beach area is so beautiful. To me this is like a really romantic place that you would maybe come with significant other. They also do a lot of retreats here too, like they're doing a women's retreat um, starting a couple days from now. They do yoga retreats. So this place is just like super beautiful if you're wanting like a romantic getaway or if you're coming for a retreat to kind of like focus on focus on you but yes definitely highly recommend so the last little thing that we're gonna go do is go jump in the sauna and the cold plunge I'm so excited Okay, we just got in the sauna. Like, where are you gonna find a sauna with this food? No. I wish that we would have come in here way before. Yesterday. Yeah, but it's okay. We're we're getting just what we needed. Mm, time for the cold plunge and maybe hit the steam room. Girl, you asked in the wrong one. You've done this. I haven't. I know, but I've never done it one of these machines. Oh! Uh-oh. This is gonna be cold! 
So we literally just stepped out of the sauna and this is, how cold is this? He said like 50 something. He said like negative 56 Celsius. Oh my gosh. How cold is it? <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're done? Are you freezing? You need to go in the sauna? Okay, good. Oh my god. Yeah, it like it's like pins and needles and then it like goes away. So we just got done doing the cold plunge in the sauna. Headed back to our room to pack up. And we just got done shooting content down at the beach. We are packing up packing up our stuff and we're gonna try to get back to Nuevo Vallarta because- um, No, we're not trying, we are gonna go back. We are getting back. <laughs> we just haven't had luck um, trying to get a car back. The guy that dropped us off here from Nuevo Vallarta is not wanting to come get us, which is fine. <laughs> uh, it's like a 40 minute drive, but it's fine. Um, so yeah, we're gonna try to get back. <laughs> We're gonna try to get back and um, then we're just gonna kind of get ready for the rest of the weekend and hopefully go to the beach and the pool. Yep. <laughs> we are leaving La Jolla. It's so pretty here. So pretty. Our car is coming to pick us up. We're paying 800 pesos to get back to Nuevo Vallarta. So we just got back to our Airbnb here in Nuevo Vallarta and I'm happy to be back in the like high rise living because we were in the jungle in like a little rustic hut, which I loved too. But uh, yeah, we're back here and we're probably gonna just vibe out, maybe go to the beach, the pool, and just hang out today. So we ordered juices from this guy I found on Instagram and he's, oh, he's delivering them to us. Um, and it's super late, or it's not that late, but it's dark. So we're gonna go get it. <laughs> Hi. Good, how are you? Good. Okay. Two of the not OJ um, and two of the deep. All right, so we're about to head down to the beach. Apparently it's in walking distance. So we just walked to the beach. It was literally like a two minute walk from our Airbnb. We are going to the Romantica area and we're going to just like see where the life takes us today. I definitely am in real estate because I'm just like looking at all of the cute like Spanish the vibes, the architecture. So freaking cute. So we're headed to the Meridor, which is like a 
observation deck area. And we're gonna go hike up it a bit. We made it. I'm dying. Literally. Now I'm doing a video. Just watch the sunset. It looks so pretty. There's so many people here, but yeah, I know why. So Everybody wanted to see it. It was a beautiful moment. It lasted about five minutes, but it was beautiful. <laughs> Not yet. So we're walking to the pool area because I've never seen the pool. And it's dark. <laughs> 